Sentry mode activated. Target acquired. Hey there Hunters and welcome back to the Gunners Guild. Today's video is going to be short. With the announcement of the next big Sunbreak trailer showcasing monsters, gameplay, and all that sort of things, I wanted to talk about the three small issues I still have with Rise that are still currently plaguing my PC experience. Now it's no surprise that I dislike Rise's PC controls, at the very least for mouse and keyboard. And this wouldn't be such an issue if they didn't put that whole optimized mouse and keyboard controls as part of the selling point for Rise on PC. It's been like, what, three, four months since PC launch? And yes, while they did make some improvements, I still have three big gripes that I hope get fixed before or with some break, most likely with. So the first thing is that the MO scroll is still broken. I still need to set the mouse wheel settings to the action bar and then run to the keyboard settings and change the action bar to my mouse three and four buttons. Otherwise, there's no way to use MO scroll and item scroll both with my mouse without having to press control. So while this still works in function, it's messed up and required a lot of experimenting to figure out how to get working. So there's a problem with the menu option screen and such. The second problem is that keybinds are still extremely limited. Not being able to have sheath and sprint to hold on the same button is crazy to me since that's how it worked in World. Toggle run is super annoying and I don't like it. Likewise, melee also can't have sheath and use item on the same button where bowguns can. Not sure why. And there's a lot of weird conflicts with what can and can't be bound to the buttons. You also can't bind an action to two buttons like control or alt and some other button. It's not really optimized at all. And the last problem is with the emulated controls, and yes, it's emulated. The way controls work is that when you bind an action to a keyboard, it's actually pressing an emulated controller input. So if I bind my left click to my fire button for shooting, and the fire is R2 on the controller, pressing left click is actually pressing R2 to fire. And now, you may be asking, well, what's the difference? Why is that an issue? Well, the problem occurs when you start getting into the multi-action buttons like the silk by buttons that you select one key to do the silk by an action, which is technically three button inputs. So rather than having it do one key to do the silk by an action, you're pressing one key to do three buttons. So rather than having it as a one to one where the actual silk by an action is set to one button, you instead press one button in my case C here, and then it presses the three to do the silk bind. This causes problems with inputs if you try to do stuff too fast. My biggest problem with this is that if you try to use silk binds for gunner after you reload or do another action, instead of using the silk bind, there's a good chance it only reads the circle input and uses your special MO instead. This should not be the case if the silk bind action was actually just bound to one button, but since it's pressing circle and triangle, it has a chance to actually just use one or the other if it doesn't come out right. And in most cases, it just uses special MO. Doing this immediately kills a run for me, or just gets me killed, because when you're using silk binds for a gunner, they typically you're using them for evasion. So instead of evading an attack, I'm stationary using special MO, and then I'm dead. It's very frustrating, and if the mouse and keyboard controls were actually optimized, this wouldn't be an issue at all. It, it shouldn't be an issue, but it still is. So these issues were in the demo, they were at launch, and they still persist in the PC version of Rise today. Uh, I just really hope they get fixed for Sunbreak, because if not, there's no way I'm sticking around for that game for very long. It's way too clunky and janky to play Rise on PC with a keyboard and mouse. And I know everyone out there is going to be like, oh, just play controller, or the game wasn't made for mouse and keyboard. Well, then they shouldn't have advertised it as such. And playing with guns feels much better with mouse and keyboard. World was fine, I don't know why Rise is such a mess. But anyway, that's all for me. Thank you all for watching, and good luck out there, hunters.